so it was. From the holes of the slave ships we unfurled on a distant shore, stripped of our humanity, but not our tenacity. We would live, and we would thrive. CSI, I know you graduated from Harvard, and yeah. I know you wrote the book, yeah. Let Us Show Young Man, yeah. but listen, this is my town, Las right. Vegas, and when you come to Las Vegas, you got to be flashy and flamboyant. Okay. I got a suit for here, you go. George, don't you think this looks good? This looks good. No. This is Prada, George. Yo, trust me, be proud of this. You sure? Where? Right. Yeah, put it, we got to go. From the magnificent Bellagio Hotel and Casino in the entertainment capital of the world, Las Vegas, welcome to the 2007 Trumpet Awards. Honoring the achievements of Tony Braxton, Nancy Brinker, Dr. Denzel Douglas, Oric Duke, Ed Dwight, Clint Eastwood, Hill Harper, Quincy Jones, Michael Jordan, J. Terrence Lanny, Donnie McClurkin, Justice Alan C. Page, Olympians Tommy Smith and John Carlos, Percy Sutton, Dionne Warwick, CeCe Wines, with special messages from former presidents George H.W. Bush and William J. Clinton. And now, please welcome your host from the hit series CSI New York, award-winning star of stage and screen, Hill Harper. Our next presenters are, are both known on an international scale. One is an Emmy award-winning journalist. The other is a gifted actress and the first lady of Turks and Caicos. Please welcome from CNN, White House correspondent, Suzanne Malvo, and first lady, Lisa Ray Missick. He may hail from a small country, but Dr. Denzel Douglas is a man with big ideas. He's determined to eradicate poverty, HIV, AIDS, and illiteracy. And he strives to ensure environmental sustainability, reduce child mortality, and achieve universal primary education. Working with other world leaders in his mission to improve the quality of not only his countrymen, but all Caribbean peoples while transforming societies around the world. I was the only medical doctor among my colleague heads of government. It was easy for me to have acquired the special responsibility of health and HIV AIDS matters. And I use that platform as a leader to pursue our fight against HIV AIDS in the Caribbean region. The relationship with President Clinton started back in Barcelona when we attended the International HIV AIDS Conference. I seized the moment and I beseeched him to help us because I believe that a very strong political leadership from him as a person, we could then double our efforts in the fight against HIV AIDS. The Prime Minister of the Federation of St. Kitts and Nevis, His Excellency, the Honorable Dr. Denzel Douglas.
Thank you. Tonight it is um, truly a very wonderful experience to be here on this special occasion when people of color from all over the world can truly celebrate our achievements. It is the environment that has been created by the people and the government of the Federation of St. Kitts and Nevis that has allowed me to be here to receive this award. Thank you very, very much. Good night. <laughs>